Sir, we're talking about how these sanctions are affecting life in Iran. You're based in Tehran right now. The IMF says in 2019, the economy will shrink another 6%. Youth unemployment is closer to 30%. And also, cost of food and medicine is somewhere up by 40 to 60%. Tell us a little, give us an insight on how life has changed since sanctions this past year. Uh, well, well, since uh, due to sanctions, uh, foreign exchange is not uh, entering the country as much as it used to do before. Uh, it's making it very difficult for the government to create job opportunities. And um, as you mentioned, the everyday life of the people has been affected, um, especially, for example, uh, the sanctions on medicines and uh, um, humanitarian aids has made it very difficult for uh, patients with um, special diseases to provide for or even find uh, their necessary uh, medicines. Mm -hmm. So this is increasing um, you, the general publics, uh, the Iranian publics. Um, and this is making them really so, angry sort of towards the, their own regime, is it not? Uh, and also the U.S. They are blaming Trump. They mm -hmm. are um, fed up with U.S.'s aggression. And yes, yes, they have uh, their grievances against the current government because uh, they believe that uh, the, co the country has enough uh, capabilities uh, that can be used uh, to create job opportunities and uh, settle the economic problems. And this is something that... Um, um, the people are expecting from uh, their own... So the, the anger government. towards the government is that it is not being as self-sufficient as it has a potential to be, or the fact that it's not coming to the table in stopping this uh, spiraling of the economy and the high unemployment rates, etc.? It's because of um, not using the, the national potentials, because we have been under sanctions for over 40 years. Mm -hmm. And although uh, these sanctions have been uh, escalated and more severe recently, but this is nothing new. And we have to um, develop an economy which is uh, not mm -hmm. so much reliant on oil exports. We have okay. always been... Um, Ex predicting that this could happen at some point because U.S.'s right. aggression towards Iran has always been in place. All right.